Good morning. Good morning, Abe. Say good morning, world. Good morning, world. Yeah. yeah. Show them your cracker. Abe's having his first little cracker. And he's not really quite sure what to do with it. Are you? We're getting there. So welcome back to my channel. Today I am going to be bringing you another week in my life. Um, a little bit better, I feel, than last week. Last week's vlog was just a lot of catching up and filling you in on where I'm at. And this week I have quite a lot going on. So I thought I'd bring you um, along for the week. I am just waiting for my mom to come and yeah, I'm gonna get ready and she's gonna take over here with Abe and I'm gonna go and do my weekly try on. And also I am meeting up with a fellow influencer today and I'm super excited because I'm pretty, not antisocial, but I'm very introverted and I get quite nervous and anxious in social situations. Um, so I tend to avoid them. Um, when I'm in them, I'm super social and I'm really able, but I just, yeah, I have my friends and I kind of just stick to them, um, which is a little bit of a crutch, I would say. But anyway, today I'm meeting up with an influencer that lives in Dublin and I'm super excited just to, I'm really craving just having a friend within the industry or even just a friend that's like really into fashion, um, understands kind of the world of creating social media content and all of that. So I'm really excited for that. Um, and yeah, I have a few other fun things this week. So yeah, let's get started. So I'm super late getting ready. I have to rush and meet um, my new friend. Uh, so excited, but I just thought I'd tell you what I'm getting while I'm getting ready. I got a new jacket from Lioness and I'm just so excited to open it. So I'm gonna show you this. Get dressed and let's go into town. Okay, here we go. I don't know if you follow them, but they are, I'm pretty sure they're an Australian brand. And for some reason you don't get uh, custom fees. Maybe a little bit, but they're actually included in the price, which I always love. Um, and the price point, I would say, is very similar to like H&M. It's kind of like an Australian um, high street brand, but not everybody has it because it's Australian, which I always love. So I'm not very into leather, but I'm very into bombers. So this is my new bomber. I am so, so excited about it what do we think i'm pretty sure i sized up but i will show you better when i have a bit more space i have literally surrounded by baby toys here my laundry drying here again if you're in ireland you know you know um so i have no space but this is it okay i'll show you better later but let's go so what a glorious day in dublin um I just finished my lunch date with my new friend. It was so nice and we literally ate the ear off each other for 90 minutes. Um, it's just so nice to be able to talk to somebody um, that has the same interests as in you, that works in the same kind of field as you. So yeah, I am meant to be going into the city center now, but it's so miserable and cold. I almost feel like maybe I'll just do it tomorrow when it's not raining. Um, but either way, I'll bring you along. So yeah, we just got to take some photos as well, which is so nice getting to work with somebody that, yeah, just you don't have to direct so much. Like with Connor, he's great. And he is very good at taking direction, but it can be, it can just take a little bit longer. Um, so yeah, that brunch in BB's is delicious. If you haven't been to BB's in Tulare, I would really recommend it. Uh, but yeah, chat in. So I decided to come into the city center. I was about to go home and like take off my makeup and get cozy, but I feel one of the really amazing things about having a baby and like having no time is that time just becomes so important and you really utilize your time. Just, just time management just becomes something that you prioritize and you don't take time for granted. Time, 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 time. Um, so yeah, having my mom and my mother-in-law 
mind aid those two days. I just feel like even though I'm exhausted and there are, you know, parts of the day where he's asleep and I just kind of want to switch off and reboot or re-energize by watching some kind of with the Kardashians or whatever, I find myself that I really use all of that time to like work on what I want. And I think it's a really, I've heard other women speak about that where they just were able to focus a lot more um, because of the lack of time they had, um, which kind of in a way shows how little time you actually need um, if you're focused. So anyway, long story short, I've come into town because I'm not wasting this um, time that I'm so lucky to have um, with my mom winding my son. So um, yeah, I'm gonna go in and uh, try on some clothes and I'll show you what I try on. I'm just in the lingerie section of Brian Thomas and I don't know if you've ever heard of this brand. Um, Olivia Von Halle, but my mum actually got a, it was kind of like a, almost like a robe, a silk robe for my wedding and she wore it as her dress. Oh my god, I actually should borrow that from her because it's like so beautiful. The stuff is just like so nice, I'll show you now. Um, but they're like pure silk and they have these like amazing designs on them. I'm just like so obsessed. there's like a matching pair of uh, silk pants with lace at the bottom that I thought I brought in to try but I didn't um, but I just am obsessed with this little button here and then it actually comes with a tie so that you can tie but I feel like this would actually be really nice around the neck I don't know if you've seen in or you follow India edit the India edit but she does this a lot um, and I am so obsessed so chic I think this for like a wedding even as an outfit but for getting ready oh my god it would be insane so unfortunately they only have the 14 in the pants but these are the silk pants that go with and I am just so obsessed with the lace bottoms and this robe that goes with So this is the one that's very similar to the one my mom got for my wedding, but it was green and it had, I can't remember the animal print, I think it was like swans or, oh my god, it was so beautiful, but um, this is a little less me, I wouldn't be into the zebra or the orange, but I just am so obsessed with the shape of this. Um, I can't really belt it properly because it's attached to the back, but my mom, what she did was she didn't use the belt. She created, got a little button put here and it just looked way more like a dress rather than a robe. So stunning. And it's also just something that nobody else will have because it's lingerie. <laughs> so I'm just packing Abe's little snacks and food for his meals today for he's going to his Maisie, which is what we call his granny on his dad's side. So in here, I put avocado, peanut butter, and banana, and she can mash it up. Um, and then that's gonna be his breakfast, which he has when he wakes up at 10. Then this is his spag ball for his dinner at three. And then I'm gonna put a few of these little um, organic savory crackers into his little snack cup. These are all from Babogue, an Irish brand, and I'm so obsessed. Um, yeah, just so aesthetically pleasing, and I love the silicone feeling, and yeah. Good morning, gorgeous people. It is a new day, and yes, that is bright sunshine streaming into my apartment. Thank the Lord. It didn't start off well today, I'll tell you that much. It was still gray and wet, and I was like, I can't cope with two days of this in a row. It's so hard for content, um, and also just for my mood in general, so. I hope the sun is shining wherever you are as well today. Um, yesterday was so fun. I really just felt really inspired and motivated by the end of the day. I just love, yeah, like I said, being with like-minded people. So I am currently in a blazer and pants and my slippers because I am 
At home creating content today, my mother-in-law has taken Abe for the day for a few hours and we are meant to be going to a track night tonight. My best friend's husband uh, runs a well, uh, running, he's a run, running coach, but he has a run club out in Greystones and we're meant to be going tonight, but I, just with babysitting and the crossovers of our two mums and having a car, getting out to Greystones, we both wanted to go and it's just not working out, which I'm devastated about. But if you're ever interested in a run club, this run club is like a whopper community and they welcome all levels, but they're super serious as well about their goals and they're just like really inspiring and help each other um, to achieve their goals. So yeah, if you're in the Greystone Spray area, definitely check them out. Um, it's IF Endurance, I'll put the link here. Um, but instead, I think myself and Connor will just go for a run later together because we never get to do that. Um, and I'll still die because Connor's way faster than I am. So um, it'll be a good workout. Anyway, I'm going to do a few videos here for Instagram, TikTok, and yeah, I will show you the things that I am styling because I got a few new bits. I, I sold so much on Depop in the last four weeks that I treated myself to a few bits because sometimes you just need to treat yourself and I'm really good at that. So um, yeah, I'll show you what I got because I got some really, really good wardrobe pieces. And yeah, I'm gonna do some styling videos today. And yeah, I'll just show you my outfit actually because it's like super cute. This is like one of my favorite blazers of all time. It's by the Sunderby, and I get asked, sorry, it's like so dark. Um, I get asked where it's from all the time, and it's like probably my only one. No, actually, I have one by Jerf Avenue, I have one actually by Marks and Spencer's um, in the men's section. Most of my blazers are the Frankie shop, but this one has to be like one of my favorites and it's by the Sunderby. It's always sold out, so sign up and um, yeah, hopefully you can get your hands on it because it is so, and it comes with a little belt as well. So you can cinch it in and like almost, I've worn it as a blazer dress before with boots. So yeah, let's get on with this content day. Also, can we take a minute for my lip combination? The Rare Beauty Lively Lip Liner, like last week. But then I'm wearing the NARS lipstick in the color Raquel. And then I am wearing the Rode uh, Peptide Lip Tint in Ribbon. And it is just bringing the feels. Okay, I just wanted to come on and show you this top that I got in Zara. Ooh, one shoulder. It's very like Jacquemus Hailey Bieber, I think. This little rope detail, like, it's a little bit annoying because it comes down, but I might like sew it slightly to the, to the top, but it is so flattering, a really nice stretchy material. That will drive me crazy as well, so I'll have to cut that off. But yeah, I'll put the um, code, the Zara code for it below. Oh my God, guys, like literally every piece that I have just unboxed, and I haven't even opened my favorite bit yet. So let's do that together, actually. I'll save it for you. Okay, I had to get changed out of that going out top. But, okay, so I don't know if you followed me on Instagram, but last week I shared my weekly wish list. Um, and one of the items was probably the priciest item on it, but it was on sale 50% off. And I made a lot of money on my Depop in the last, few, in the last month, like I said. And I decided to take the plunge. Um, I'm hoping that I don't regret it. Um, I really don't think I do because it's one of my favorite brands. So, oh my god, I just love the color so much. So, one of my favorite brands is Acne. One of my favorite things to wear, and in my opinion, one of the easiest things to wear and to rewear over things on its own, layer it with a coat, is a blazer. So, I got this, and, oh my god, I'm so obsessed, let's try it on. So, one of the only sizes they had left was extra small, small, 
or like extra large large and I know that acne is already oversized so I went with the extra small small I would have preferred a small medium but let me see if that's yeah the size is 34 which I think is a UK 8 so I would always in outerwear go for like a 10 or even sometimes a 12 but oh my god it is it's so perfect. I love the double breasted. I'm obsessed with the collar and I'm also obsessed with these shoulders. Um, yeah, and I don't think it needs to be any more oversized. I actually think it's, it's pretty damn perfect. Like I feel, I saw it styled on this one that wore it with like a little white slip dress underneath actually not just a little white slip dress, the Prada slip dress, which I'm so obsessed with. And I'll put a photo of it here. Oh my God, it's just like, if I was to yeah, be a millionaire, that's what I would live in. Um, but she wore that with this over it. So I'm hoping that I can wear like little dresses. Yeah, this is it. What do you think? Oh my God, I'm just like beyond obsessed. So I'm finished with my work for the day. I have to rush and go get Abe, but I just put on um, my hyaluronic acid and I'm gonna go in with my new Summer Fridays. I am so excited to try this. Actually, I wonder if this is the bigger 64. I think this is the bigger um, tube or size and it's actually pretty small, but anyway, we'll see. I have heard all the hype, so see how much I suppose you just lather it on as a face mask but then you leave it on you don't have to wash it off and I am obsessed with feeling moisturized I have really dry skin um so all the oils all of the creams so it's unscented which I like because I don't like things that are overly scented I do like a little bit of a smell but so it actually does feel super thick, super creamy. Really has done the trick. And now I'm gonna go in with Ole Henriksen. I love the smell of this. It's almost like seaweed. So you only need like two to three drops warm it up in my hands and then oh that is a nice combination okay oh i feel good okay so i'm gonna go pick up abe and because we're not going on our run um or to track night and um, myself and connor are gonna go for a run together and i just looked outside and it's pissing rain by far the best steak in Dublin. I'm always ordering steak. Well, I was always ordering steak when I used to go out for dinner until host, and now I can't order steak anywhere else because it's just never as good as host. So anyway, I would really recommend. We had a really nice time, and then we went to um, Layla's afterwards. Actually, maybe Layla's is the rooftop. We went to that hotel anyway, and it was, Lovely, really nice service and yeah, 
definitely celebrating our friend's birthday. And we are now en route to Airfield, which I was just saying to Connor is a dream come true. That sounds really grim, but honestly, doing family things are just um, exciting because I've always wanted babies and getting in-laws together and cousins and so I'm really excited just to do something with the family and uh, focusing on this being the reason we came home to Dublin. Um, somebody commented on my YouTube video last week asking uh, for tips on how to focus on the good things when you move home and I would say the first few weeks we came back we were we made a mistake of not making plans and I think it's just really important to make as many plans as you can for weekends even if it's just one um it's yeah it just gives you a bit of focus and uh yeah so we're really excited to go up see all the animals and uh Abe will get to see his little cousin who's only six weeks older than him so uh yeah I'll bring you along and let you know if it's worth doing with the family. No, they're, they're over there. Do you see the baby? So dreamy after all. Airfield, I would not recommend. Now, maybe we were very unlucky, but animals yonks away, Abe could barely see them, and oh, it's just it was pretty grim to be honest. Um, so, the new kids' playground in Blackrock Park has opened this weekend, so very exciting. It's only about a 10 minute walk from us, so we're going down to check out the playground, and it is finally a glorious day. What do you think, Angel? What do you like? Do you see all the babies? And the swings? Will we queue up for the swings? Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. So exciting. Yeah. 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 